Hey guys, so it's over 100 degrees in Pacific Northwest and that's just not normal. And you guys have to see what the squad is doing right now. They're in the house and the house is not bad, but I think that the heat is just coming in and they feel it. The morning walks are not as crazy as they usually are, you know, we just keep it shorter because it's super, super hot. So you guys have been asking us, what do we feed them? What do we give them for snacks in the summer? And that is such a good question because watermelon is amazing. Not only does it cool anyone down that eats it, it's really hydrating and it has so much water in it, but it's such an easy snack to do for dogs. It's absolutely amazing. So I'm gonna show you guys what we do. It's a really cool little trick, how to make it super cold in the summer for them so they get to enjoy it even more than ice cubes. So what I do is I just cut it up in half and we've been eating watermelon like crazy. So there it is. Ooh, this is a nice one. I cut it in half. Usually by now, the squad would be up and they would want some, but they're just sleepy from the heat. And then I cut it in half again, so it's like quarters. And this is so awesome. It's so easy. It takes a few minutes to make, but this is like heaven for them. So you can either cut it like this I do it the easier way where I just, I would say about two fingers wide. I cut it with the peel, super easy. Flip it on the other side, it's a long watermelon. And there it is. All right, look how easy you guys. We're gonna make them into the perfect squares. So I just cut it like this, and like this. If there are any black seeds, make sure to remove them. I like to make them perfect squares, so after I finish cutting it... Babies, you want some watermelon? You want a watermelon? Oh, good boy. Here. There you go. Oh, good girl, Kimari. Tiger's not in the kitchen. You already know that. So anyways... I cut these perfect squares, I get snacks of it, but what I'm gonna do after I cut them in perfect squares, I'm gonna freeze them for at least two hours. So I get this bucket or this tray or whatever you have and just separate them so they don't touch and you put them all nicely aligned without touching and you freeze it for two hours. I swear our pups love it. And it's so cool because you can prep it and have it in the freezer and you can give it to them when it's hot. They enjoy it so, so, so much. Up, up, babies! You know you can't handle it? Come here, girl! No more! Later more, okay, when it's frozen. 